Hi, my name is Andy Parks and I'm the Executive Director of the Vintage Arrow Flying Museum. And today we're standing amongst the displays, in particular with our display for David Peterson. David McEvely Peterson, who was an original member of the Escadrille Lafayette. Those are the Americans that flew with the French prior to us getting into the war, 1916 through 1917. David, who was a pilot prior to joining the service, um, learned to fly with the Curtis Flying School and in 1916 sails over to France to join the French Foreign Legion. Once he joined, he quickly transferred into the French Air Service and in the spring of 1917 was breveted a pilot. Upon his uh, being breveted, he joined the Escadrille Americaine or Escadrille Lafayette in June of 1917. Matter of fact, the same day one of our other persons in the collection joined James Norman Hall. David Peterson was well liked by his fellow squadron mates in the Escadrille and he was well known for going out on as many sorties as possible. He was a man that enjoyed getting into the fight. In 1917 when America gets into the war and we look to take the Lafayette pilots into our air service we transferred David and the other Lafayette pilots into our 103rd Aero Squadron. That's the Indian Head or Sioux Aero Squadron for the Americans. And David would transfer over as a captain and serve with the 103rd, um, gaining one victory. He would then be transferred the same day again with James Norman Hall into the 94th Aero Squadron and actually take the first All-American sortie over the front in uh, April of 1918 along with Eddie Rickenbacker. David would then be transferred as a major and gain the command of the 95th Aero Squadron. That's the Bucking Mule Squadron and the fabric that's in the case here with David's mannequin is from his SPAD 13. It's unique because only on the commander's plane did the Bucking Mule not have a blue background. And also in this case are David's medals his uh, Distinguished Service Cross, his Croix de Guerre, and a most rare piece, his Escadrille Lafayette membership badge. And you see that displayed here. David would go on to become a six victory ace and survive the war, but only to be killed in 1919 in a training accident when he was instructing on a DH-9. David Peterson or Major David Peterson, one of the American pilots in our museum at the Vintage Arrow Flying Museum. Hope you enjoyed today's talk.